I'm presenting a uh, sculpture for my next body of work at Jan Murphy's. Sculpture is, is quite a departure for me. Um, it's been an interesting process. Yeah, working with my own figure, with my own image, um, but sort of it's becoming more and more removed um, through this process of casting and recasting and manipulating. The sculpture came about because I wanted to make some self-portraits, but I didn't want to work from a mirror. It's a bit restrictive. I didn't really want to work from photographs either, so I decided to make a life-size, quite faithful reproduction of my own head in plasticine, and then paint from that, so that I could, just a, a way of being a little bit more objective about looking at yourself. The original pieces are made with plasticine, um, which is a really interesting material because I can either melt it and pour it into a mould or I can freeze it and smash it. Um, so it, or I can warm it with my hands and manipulate it and move it like um, putty. At the end I've basically cast the, the final piece in um, bronze which is obviously a very permanent material. Then I've decided to paint the work so that you can see the original material again that it was made, made of. When you see something in bronze, you, you just think of the metal that you're looking at. And I, I didn't want that to distract from the fact that it was made by this very diverse, malleable, uh, very impermanent um, substance. With a painting, you're... you're you can't really lose much control of it, but with, a, with this material, some of the sculptures I would freeze and then smash with an axe and they splinter and they do all sorts of things that, um, that is beyond your control. So it was really nice to let those things happen and then literally like sweep up the bits and then start to work them back together and, and have control again also really interesting when you attack a um, you know a wax cast of your own head with a axe or with a hammer or with a saw or with a hot knife or you know it, it was actually it was fun and sort of cathartic as well to do these things to your own image I guess you're addressing things about yourself, about your image, about your insecurities and all that sort of thing that come into the work in a more subconscious way. The painting, every mark you make with a paintbrush, you have to be, you're in control of. So, yeah, letting go of some of that control through the material is, um, was a great way to go about it, I think.